in the last few days i was talking to multiple people who are actually working in sap btp that is business technology platform and when i was talking to john who has introduced himself as a btp service developer he is primarily working in service developments with capm framework in nodejs and then when i was chatting with ila who is a experienced developer working in reputed organization as a full stack btp cloud developer i got to know she has skill with service development database developments and as well as front end developments and then my expectations gone high and then i made a wonderful and very knowledgeable person david who is working as a btp architect and full stack btp developer and he is dealing with database development service developments front end developments and above all he is having very good knowledge on all btp backing services and as my expectations already gone high i was looking for better and better btp architect who can actually help our organizations digital transformation and bring real intelligent enterprise solutions then finally i met jesse who was already working as btp architect with database developments service developments front end developments and having profound knowledge on btp backing microservices and as well as she is quite hands on with intelligent technologies like ai machine learning sap conversational ai sap ai business services and so on now with all these personas let me welcome you to the sap btp architect training with low code and no code developments hello my name is parth and i have been working as btp and cloud architect and delivered several btp projects for multiple international clients i will be your lead instructor throughout this training where i will be bringing all my real time project experience in this training and if you want to become like jesse this training is for you so what is btp sap btp that is business technology platform is a pass that is platform as a service offered by sap to their customers to help and accelerate their digital transformation journey and sap is supporting this platform with mainly four pillars first thing first that is database and data management then analytics and then application development and integration where we will be learning extension suite and integration suite and of course the intelligent technologies we will be learning all these possible technologies microservices tools framework to become a confident btp architect like jesse but don't worry if you do not have experience with any programming language or any cloud technologies we will start from the very scratch level here and handhold you throughout this journey so if you are curious about what are the topics you will be learning throughout this training here you go you can see we have covered from the landscape level setup then you will be learning lots of lots of topics in extension suite integration suite database and data management and intelligent technologies if you want please give a pause here and check out the topics from bottom to up in each category now to help you imagine the real btp project here i am bringing a 3d btp project model which i generally explain at the beginning of btp architect training here you can see different skill set person working in their core areas in a big btp project so first have a look on btp managers activities this person is responsible for all the btp platform setup related activities like landscape setup activities like dev quality and production sub account 
user and developer onboarding, role assignments, entitlement enablements, and various admin related activities. Then comes to the application developer, who is kind of a hero in this picture, who is mainly developing applications, services using cloud application programming model in business application studio, maintaining code base versions and collaborating with others using Git, then developing applications and deploying it in Cloud Foundry runtime, and also responsible for application service securities using app router, XSUA based microservices. And on top of that, application developer would be responsible for job scheduling, for batch data processing, then developing alert notification services, then cloud workflow based developments as well. Then to develop any application, we need data, right? And here we will be using HANA Cloud as our primary database option. Here we will be building S4 HANA side by side extension application in BTP. For that, we need to bring data from S4 HANA. And we will be working on smart data integration for this particular purpose. We'll work on data virtualization, flow graph building, replication task for data transformation and loading into HANA Cloud. So when we'll have all our data in HANA Cloud, we'll be developing data models in Business Application Studio. We'll learn how to build calculation views, database procedures, and so other artifacts. And we'll be consuming all these database artifacts in our application services as well. When we are ready with application backend business logics and data, then we will be building low code and no code based application front end. And we will work on CRUD queue operations. Then we will be working on intelligent technologies to build chatbots. And also we will be seeing how to bring automations with intelligent technologies using IRPA. So, as I said earlier, there will be lots of learning and all with real project use case scenarios. And this is just a sneak peek. You will be learning lots of lots of tools, technologies, frameworks, microservices and various BTP based solutions.